What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash this sub button to be notified for future readings. This is a free general collective reading. Cup suicide to everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate. Free general collective reading. I got uh, some channeled in, so I'm going to share them. Um, I hope everybody is doing well on this 4-29-2022 day. If you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess 205. The link's in the description box below. PayPal only. No cash up, no Venmo. I do not publicly display your name if you choose to donate through my PayPal. Okay, so the channel message I received was, um, someone has intentionally poisoned someone's animal. Um, some a cat, some a dog, some a llama. A llama. I didn't know you could have a llama as a pet. Um, just saying, just saying. Or maybe somebody raises llamas on a farm or something. I mean, I don't know. I heard cat, dog, and llama. Like L-L-A-M-A. -A. Um, but I heard it's about to seriously backfire. I heard the spirit of the animal is about to start haunting this person in a huge way. And then like 45 seconds after that, I heard someone is about to, through many series of chain events, someone is about to find their animal in a, um, in a very positive way. Unexpected. I heard for some a cat, for some a dog, for some a bird. So you plug it in how it resonates. So someone intentionally has already poisoned it sounds like in the universe somebody's cat dog or llama um just saying don't want no drama llama um and it sounds like the animal has passed away or is about to pass away in the situation number one and the spirit of the animal i heard is about to start seriously haunting the person that um or people that intentionally poison the cat dog or llama that's situation one situation two somebody's animals missing whether it's a cat dog or a bird um a bird i mean just saying um um but you're about to find the cat dog or bird through um many series of positive chain of events unexpectedly um so that's very positive so situation one um is a cat dog or llama situation number two is a cat dog or a bird so uh, however this plugs in this could be you or somebody you're connected to only you know your story not anybody else wow <laughs> that's crazy spirit messages okay foundation reverse awakening reverse Get another one. Spare okay. Oh my lord. So many. Oh, actually, not really. Not really. Okay. We have homecoming reversed. Intensification upright. With manifestation upright. Okay. So um foundation reversed. So I'm taking this as um, the missing animal or the animal that has um, about to be poisoned or is, is already poisoned in the universe or the animal that's lost and about to be found. I feel you're ungrounded. Uh, whoever you are, if you resonate with situation one or two, you're ungrounded and um, you want to find your animal. For some, you will. It sounds like in situation two. For situation one, I think you'll be ungrounded when you realize they've passed away or they don't come home. Um, how that resonates. This is sad. Homecoming reversed. This is the lost animal I'm feeling. The spirit of this animal, for some animals, will really, really haunt, really, really haunt badly this uh, person for some, people for some. Oh, my Lord. So, I'm assuming that's situation one. Um, you know, the animal's not going to come home um, because they, they they either already have been poisoned or they're about to be poisoned. Are the um, animals, for some, it sounds like it's one animal that's been poisoned or is about to be poisoned. For some, it's two animals that have been poisoned or is about to be poisoned, whether it's a cat, dog, or a llama. Um, but I heard that spirit of the animals is about to haunt the person or people that has done this. It sounds like they premeditated this poisoning and it's, the animal spirits are about to haunt 
the person or people that premeditated this murder of the animal or animals. Um, I think they premeditated the murder of the animal or animals to get you all riled up, to get you upset, to get you emotional. Um, whoever you are, if this resonate, if you resonate situation one, situation two, homecoming reverse is you missing your animals. I'm feeling, um, but soon through series of positive series of time events, it's going to be homecoming upright. It sounds like, um, it sounds like it hasn't happened yet, but right now it's homecoming reversed. You miss your animals, animal or animals, whether it's a cat, dog, or a bird. Whoever you are and how that resonates. Intensification upright. In one of these situations, someone will tell you who poisoned your animal and animals for some. You will go to the police. Oh my Lord. Wow. I heard in one of the situations, someone is going to, it sounds like they're going to come to you and tell you who has poisoned your animal or animals. So your cat, dog, or llama, uh, or llamas, or cats, or dogs, however that resonates. Um, and I heard you will go to the police. So intensification, um, I'm, you're going to be upset. You're going to be fiery. You're going to be in your emotions and feelings. Um, and you're going to take action. In this situation, I'm feeling intensification is action here. Um, after someone comes and tells you, it sounds like someone in the uh, 3D is going to come tell you who done this. Because somebody kn knows or is about to find out. And it's going to create intensification, I'm feeling, with a police report um, with the police um, after you find out this information. Um, hopefully they, I do something about it and I'm serious. This is terrible. For some, they attempted to put black magic on the animal before poisoning them, but it, it has backfired and it's going to continue to backfire. Oh, my Lord. Wow. For some of these situations, they try to put black magic on the animal, I heard, before they poison them. Uh, wow. This is intense. Uh, and I heard that has backfired. So, or is going to backfire. And it's going to continue to backfire. And the continuing of the backfiring will be when the spirit animal haunt them in the um, 5D spiritual realm. And I'm just being for real about that. So, intensification. Intensification of the situation whether it's black magic wielders or not. Um, yikes. Manifestation. Someone is, was really trying to get you in your feelings so you would not manifest, but it's about to, about to backfire on them in a huge way. Okay, I heard someone was really trying to get you in your feelings so you would not manifest, but it's about to backfire on them in a huge way. So whoever you are, um, whether your animal is just lost or somebody intentionally took it and poisoned it and tried to put black magic on it possibly, um, I'm feeling in this situation, this situation you just lost your animal, I'm feeling, and you're about to find it through a series of positive chain of events. This situation, somebody premeditated taking your animal, like strategically to get you in your feels and emotions so you wouldn't manifest. But I heard basically it's about to backfire on them in a huge way. Um, it sounds like you're going to manifest anyways, whether they want you to or not. Uh, they want to get you depressed down in your feels and emotions so you will not manifest. I'm feeling money, time, energy. Well, I'm feeling money or people um, or positive connections here, um, manifestation. Um, it could be any of those things. But um but it's about to backfire on them. It sounds like you're going to manifest money, people, or positive connections or um, situations regardless. Whoever you are and how this resonates. And I feel they're mad. Intensification. They're in their feelings because you are manifesting. All right, let me see if I hear anything else. If you think anyone else could benefit from these messages, you guys, if you wouldn't mind sharing my videos, social media, and word of mouth, I very much appreciate it. Okay, I didn't.
I didn't. All right, you guys. Well, I hope this helped. I love you guys so much and namaste.